Hi Taurus, welcome to my channel Answers by Divine. This is going to be for the whole year of 2019 for the sign of Taurus for the whole year of 2019. I would um, recommend that you would also watch your ascendant, either your sun or your ascendant. All right, no moon, no Venus, just your sun or ascendant and or ascendant. Okay, let's begin. No, uh, I have four decks. I will be doing four spreads for you. Four spreads for you. Okay, so let's begin. For the sign of Taurus, in the whole year of 2019, what do we have for the sign of Taurus for the whole year of 2019? One last shuffle. One last shuffle for the sign of Taurus. Can we have some spreads to tell us about Taurus? Okay. Taurus, this is your reading. Forcing your way manifestation making things happen for yourself regardless of what regardless of what okay the bottom of the deck we have the high priestess in reverse the high priestess is divine timing when the high priestess go goes into reverse this is about you pushing you pushing your way through nothing like good or bad but I mean, I could see the determination over here with the High Priestess telling me that you're definitely going to make it. You, To you, it's either you make it or you break it. That's it. Period. Okay. Let's see. Let me just shuffle the next spread. And, uh... Some of you are thinking of a new plan, one, wanting to start something new in this whole year of 2019. You want to start to uh, start some new projects start some new initiative start something new for yourself a new change a new whatever that's new but it feels a lot more like a continuation a continuation to what to what or where you have uh, last left off or what you have begin for yourself there is a continuation over here like you want it, it is looking a lot more like expansion expansion that i'm seeing over here the chariot but it is not moving for you because the chariot is in reverse that's what it's telling me Whatever that you're trying to push through, new projects, new initiative, new, anything new, anything new, more like a con three of cups. Uh, this is a lonely journey, right? <clears throat> but it doesn't it doesn't seem to it doesn't seem to be working out for you in the sense that you don't have the tools, you don't have the material, you don't have the support behind you to do the things that you want to do. It's almost like a very lonely journey. That's what I'm hearing for you. It is a long, lonely journey. You're in it, you're in this, you're in this alone. Almost like no one is there for you. Um, but I feel like probably no one knows about your situation, Taurus, whatever that you're going through, not many of them, not many people know what you're going through. You probably didn't tell it to them or no one seems to be interested in your life in a way okay and that makes you that makes you doubt that makes you doubt yourself are you on the right track are you on the right track why is it that no one seems to take interest in you in your life in in how you grow what how have you been some of you might might be in a separation from family friends or just generally society it just seems like no one is interested to know what's your updates Taurus All of that that you are doing, all of that that you are doing, what I'm seeing over here, the returns are not justifiable. All that you have done, all the efforts that you have put in, the, the returns are not justifiable. I'm not saying that there's no returns. I'm saying there's returns, but the returns are not justifiable. It is not well paid off. That's, I mean, if you, if you know what I'm saying. Ten of Swords is in reverse. I'm seeing people coming against you, people against your idea, people against your growth. It's almost like, you know, when you want to grow, when you want to expand, when you want to add something in your life, could be could be adding a person into your life, I mean, having a plus one or whatsoever, it's almost like people are telling you, no, you need to settle on one before you move on to another. You need to have to take care of yourself. You need to take care of your basis, your basic your basic life before you expand into more but the, the way i'm looking at you taurus how you're wanting to drive your life right now not wanting to drive your life in fact that's how you're driving your life right now before you get one thing done you're proceeding on to another almost like sometimes it, it looks like multitasking to me
I'm feeling almost like no one is with you, Taurus. No, I mean, I'm not going to read the cards by card. I mean, but that's what I'm getting. That's what I'm hearing. No one is with you in this journey. No one, no one's supportive of you. No one's asking about you. What do you need? How can I help you? You know, I mean, anyone who's watching this who's not a Taurus will find this a very general reading. But for you, Taurus, if you're listening to this, if this is your life, you will know what I'm saying over here. No one's with you. No one is with you. This is a long, lonely journey, a long, lonely, a long road ahead. I could see you turning your back away when people are telling you their opinions and how you should be doing things. You're almost like... Talk to my hands. Don't don't tell me what to do. This is my life. This is my thing, right? This is this is what you. This is what this is your bread and your butter. This is your life. It's and I could see you telling them. Don't tell me what to do. This is my life. No support. No support. One last shuffle. We'll take another spread. We have a total of four spreads, so let's see one last shuffle. And for Taurus 2019. For those of you watching right immediately after I've got this uploaded, you know that I'm doing this in only in the month of March. Only in the month of March, okay? So, so, um, let's just see. The fool, the lovers, the fool and the lovers. Okay, so as of now, in the month of March, whatever that you're hearing from me could be the first quarter of the year, could be the first quarter of the year, into the next quarter of the year. So I have got four spread over here. Let's just say one spread for one quarter. The second spread that I've laid out over here would be the second quarter of the year. Second, second quarter will be April, May, and June, right? We have the full, a new start, new beginning with the lovers. Some of you might be in, might be getting yourself a partner, a partner, partnership, marriage, or whatsoever. Some of you are getting married in this quarter. If it's not a, a general life, but for those of you who is not getting married, many of you would come up, uh, come upon, come across, uh. I would say I would say very good opportunity. There's a very good opportunity for you coming your way. Some of you, if you're looking for jobs, it seems like there was there's gonna be one very fantastic opportunity opportunity of what what the hell opportunistic opportunistic right opportunistic job king of wands yeah you know you're wanted <laughs> you're wanted. We have we're looking at this king of wands, so I'll show you how it looks like. Okay, so this pair over here, could you see the king of wands here looking at the lovers? This is and all right. So the first card, this is the love, uh, the fool, starting a new beginning, followed by the lover. So you might have formed a partnership. For those of you in business, uh, I know many of you Taurus are very into money. Like Taurus are so money minded so money minded right so many of you if you're if you're not in if you're not employed if you're self-employed you would have find yourself a, a a partner to expand whatever that you want to expand to help you along the way in one way or another indirectly sometimes you might leverage on on what they have to offer all right so but otherwise if you're not a businessman if you're just employed and holding a job I feel that some of you might have very good job coming your way. If any one of you is interviewing, is wanting to make a change in your job, it seems like in this quarter you will get it. You should get something really good for yourself. Even if it doesn't seem like so to you, I'm telling you this is a very good job that's going to hold you in there for long term. All right, and this king of wands is looking at the lovers here. So you are wanted that this king of wands is someone who has strong desire, who has strong, strong needs. I mean, needing you, needs you, wants you, you're like a gem. They found a gem. They found a gem. They found you. You're a gem to them, right? So you might not know. I feel like many of you would not know, would not see, would not see it as how I see it. But I'm telling you, this is how the other, whoever that you're forming a partnership with, could be a job, could be a business partner, or maybe just love, 
right? This person wants you. This person wants you much. You would help them in many, in many big ways. In many big ways. You might, you just might not know it. You just might not know it. In a way, they might be leveraging on what you have to offer on the table, right? But I just feel like many of you would not know it. As we speak, as we speak that many of you would not know what this King of Wands wants from you. I feel like at a certain, to a certain extent, to a certain extent, you might feel that you have been made use of. If that's simple enough to understand, you might feel that people are taking advantage of you or making use of you or just taking things and not... Um, just taking things away, taking energies away from you, taking the good vibes away from you, taking away your skill, your skill set, taking away your resources, taking away your resources. This is how you would feel about this. Not for everyone. Yeah. But I just feel like you don't see. So after the first spread, I'm seeing in the second. So I laid out uh, nine cards in rows of threes. So the first three cards and after that the next three cards I've got you five of cups this is about you feeling sorry about something feeling bad about something feeling emotional about something over here the five of cups over here and it's maybe this lovers this partnership over here is not exactly what is serving you at its best in a way it doesn't pay it doesn't pay off well you don't get your returns you don't get your returns you don't get you know to you things needs to be both ways things need to go both ways but you don't just don't see as how it potentially can be both ways will be both ways This is a missed opportunity. In this second quarter, in this second quarter, I see you missing an opportunity because it began so well, but towards the next other rows, towards the next other cards, I'm seeing you walking away. I'm seeing you walking away. Walking away to where you last left off before you joined, before you merge into this partnership. Partnership that I'm talking about, Taurus. This partnership that I'm um, that I'm talking about over here might be a challenging partnership. Reason being, um, there might be differences when it comes to uh your way or their way. What they believe, what they believe will work, and what you believe will work. Let's take more cards. One last shuffle for Taurus 2019 from this legacy deck. Can we have more cards to tell about Taurus? Let's look into the third quarter, third quarter for Taurus 2019. Partnership is gonna is gonna take up a big a major part of your time in this year. Your mind, your life, everything will revolve a lot around partnership collaborating collaborating coming together working things working out with someone is a lot about teamwork guys it's, it is a lot about teamwork bottom of the deck we have a four of swords you know taurus you just don't trust anybody's opinion you just don't trust anybody's opinion you know how it's like when people make recommend recommendations to you 
you'll be like, hmm, you will you will not take you will not take the word the val the the surface value of it. You will you still believe in yourself. You still believe in what you think is good when it comes to a certain kind of recommendation. Let's just say, for example, if someone recommend you a restaurant, you will say, hmm, you know, you would you would doubt the, this recommendation because. You know, it's just naturally, it's just, it is just you. And when I see you coming in to talk about teamwork, when I see the, the Three of Cups is coming back, Three of Cups is here. I mean, not that it's coming back, but, but Three of Cups is a lot about coming together, reuniting. Some of you could be reconciling if this is a love, if there's anything about love over here. Some of you could be reconciling. Any form of partnership, there'll be reconciliation. So that's the reason why I'm saying in this year, 2019, a lot of partnership will be hovering around your life. A lot of partnership. Teamwork, colleagues, friends, coming, getting together, being around with people, it will kind of sometimes irritate you or annoy you. Friends, social circle, business network, whatever. King of Swords. Ten of Wands is in reverse. The world is in upright, Knight of Wands is in reverse. The star, <clears throat> Six of Cups, Ten of Coins. Taurus, I just want to tell you that you have to put yourself out there. You have to put yourself out there. Because I'm seeing a ten of coins. Who can bring you ten of coins? The lovers, the three of cups. A lot of partnership. Partnership will bring you somewhere. If you want to do anything, if you want to, if you want to push through in life, you have to work with people. You have to work with people, or otherwise, at least be a people person. You have to put yourself out there. I mean, it sounds very general, but for any one of you who's in this life that I'm talking about, you will know what I'm saying. If you feel stuck in your life right now, as of whenever you're watching this, if you feel stuck, this is a message that I'm, wanted, I'm wanting to tell you. You have to go network. You have to do networking, social, personal life network, dating, whatever. If you're single for the longest time, you have to network. You have to go out, go for dates. Just go. I know you just you will filter and you will have you will qualify people. I'm just telling you, just go. That's for personal. Any one of you who wants to listen as a personal, as a love coming from uh who wants to talk about love, who has big interest about love, you have to go out. You have to go get yourself dates. Set up dating appoint set up dates and appointments. But otherwise on the on a personal growth level, like your work, career, your business, whatever. You have to work. You have to take the initiative to talk. Take the initiative to work with people, to approach. You're not going to be approached this year. You will have to make the approach this year. You have to make the approach. You have to be the people person over here. And I'm telling you, if you be the people person, if you do more than taking more, if you if, yeah, if you do more, then, then you take more. I'm telling you, success is just around you. Success is around you. Ten of Wands is in reverse. This is all about accountability, responsibilities, burdens on your back. This is in reverse. You're not gonna, you know, don't. I'm telling you just for this once. For this once, if you do this, Ten of Wands is in reverse. Ten of Wands in reverse. If you do this, meaning to say you shoulder on, you carry on more responsibilities, you do be the one who do more. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Don't. It really doesn't matter. Just be the one who who give more, who does more. I'm telling you, what do you have? You have the wall and the star. The wall is your is the middle is the middle of the whole spread of the nine cards. This is the wall, and then we have the star. I'm not sure if it's clear. Yeah, this is the world. Look at this person here. You're gonna be free like a man. Oh, it's it's gonna feel so good. It's gonna feel so good. I don't care. I mean, you might you 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 just might be might feel that you know why should I be the one doing more? 
But I'm telling you, if you do it, if you do it, you're gonna feel so good. Mm. The emperor is in reverse. Don't be the don't. I know Taurus, you're meant to be the leader. You're meant to be the leader. You're meant to be. Yeah, this is what you want to see yourself. You are. You're not a person who is to be told. To be told to do things. You're a person who who tells who tell who tells people to do what what to do. But in this case, the emperor is in reverse. Ten of Wands is in reverse. I'm telling you, you have to put lower put yourself down put yourself lower if you want to push through if you want to push through if you want to have a breakthrough in this year you want something different for yourself you want the best the best thing the the best people the opportunities the the good thing the money or whatever i'm telling you you have to put yourself down You're gonna have a great time. I'm telling you, you're gonna have a great time in the in the month in the in summer time, which is July, August, and September. If you do this, if you do this, if you put yourself lower, you're gonna have a breakthrough. You're gonna have a break breakthrough by summer time, by the end of summer time. Is is it? I'm telling you, it's not gonna feel. It's not gonna feel comfortable. It's not gonna feel comfortable because when I see in the earlier spread where I told you the fool and the lovers and the king of wands, whatever, that's the second quarter, the second spread. For you to walk out is easy. I see I see it's easy. You will feel this way. You feel oh, I don't have to deal with shitty people anymore. I don't have to deal with crap anymore. You feel good. And with this spread, I'm telling you. To lower yourself, to put yourself lower in order to have a breakthrough. I'm feeling so strongly many of you Taurus are looking for a breakthrough. I do not know what breakthrough for every one of you are, but you're waiting for the one day the breakthrough to happen in your life. It's not going to be easy. Four, number four of swords. By numerology, four is about you have to roll. You just have to roll with the vibe. You just have to roll with events. How things unfold, you have to roll with it. The outcome by the last, by the end of summer, in the third quarter, we had the Ten of Pentacles. I'm telling you, I'm just telling you, be a people person, be approachable, take the initiative, teamwork, come together, reunite, union, put yourself low. I know, I know, it is not your style, it is not your thing. But I'm telling you, try something different. And you, you will tell me, I've tried, I've tried, I've tried, I've done all I could. Though people will start to put in the comments, who said that I didn't try? I did, I did, you know, I did all I could. But I'm just telling you, try again. <laughs> I'm so excited for you, Taurus, but I know you will never listen. Many of you, Taurus, you're like a bull. It's so hard to talk to you. When I tell you certain things, when people tell you things, you'll be like, yeah, I tried. Who said I didn't try? I'm telling you to what extent, to what degree have you have you really tried? Take the humble pie, eat the humble pie. One last shuffle for the last quarter of Taurus. I'm telling you, I'm really excited. The world, the star, and the ten of coins. It can't go any better than that. It cannot go any better than that. And if you're into money, if you're into breakthrough in your finances, end of summer. August, September, August and September, July will still, July you will start to see the change in energy where the second half of the year is going to look better for you. Let's look at the last quarter. Three of Cups again. Guys, I really want to show you. This is coming together, lowering yourself, lower yourself, put yourself together. Even though you don't belong to that category, but group yourself with the rest of them. Talking about breakthrough, I don't know why am I driving this reading towards a breakthrough. Do you see the two doors over here? Do you see the stairway, the stairway up to universe and then you see two doors? You're not going to only get one door, you're going to get two doors. 
And by then, when you come to these two doors, it is your game. Whose game is this? This is going to be your game, your choice. You, you will be given these two doors. So this is how it looks like. Three of Cups, followed by the Hangman in reverse, progressing. When you come into union, when you come into union, when you go into partnership, when you collaborate, when you take the initiative to, to, be, to approach, right? You will be the Hangman in reverse. That's where you move. That's where you see your breakthrough. Breakthrough to what? To many good, to many good things, to many more doors to come. For any one of you who's thinking about the past, I do not know what past meant to you. Past person, past place, past job, plus e past event. Cut that off. It's not going to work for you. Past partner, past love, whatever you call it. It's not going to work for you. Cut that off. Yeah. The past... Put it this way. Whoever you're still in contact with, fine, you can keep them. As we're talking, as we're talking and as you're watching whichever month that you come to see this video, as we're talking, anyone whom you have already lost contact, never, never get in touch with them again. Never. Even if they want to come back, love, business, partnership, past job, job offers that you, that you have rejected, jobs that you have resigned place that you have moved away don't never go back never this is six of cups right six of cups this is the past it's not good it is in reverse it is not good why because the devil right we had the devil over here and the six of swords again six of swords is in reverse you if you go back to the past right the past, all this past, the six of cups, the, the past, the six of swords of the past is the devil in your life. It is the devil in your life. This devil might come back to you towards the end of the year. Towards the end of the year. As we speak, I feel like some of you in the early part of the year might have, might have uh, pulled out from a partnership, might have separated from a partnership. I mean relationship, partnership, whatever you call, whatever you call it, right? In the last quarter of the year, the last quarter, which is October, November, December, potentially this person might contact you, or you might want to contact this person. I'm telling you, don't, don't. Any person, anything that you have already cut off, no longer in touch, let it be all the way until the end of this year until the end of this year just remember the only one thing i need you to remember for this whole reading any past person past partner past bosses past colleagues anyone who comes back don't just don't feel like don't feel like you are you are uh, you are a a, a a hot favorite amongst uh amongst or the thorns amongst the roses or whatsoever. Don't feel don't 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 feel like that. It, it is not gonna look like that. It is not gonna look like that. The rule of thumb in generally in life, whatever has passed, whoever would who's gone should just stay there. Lock your doors. The moon is in reverse. This is four of cups and ace of cups. Yeah. I'm seeing the past past things, past events are coming back to you in the end in the end of this year. In the end of this year. Or maybe actually not necessarily the end of this year, but any time in this year. What's gonna work for you? Everything new. New 
or existing contacts, existing friends, social network, existing, existing, not those whom you have, you have lost touch, not those whom you have cut out. No, the moon is in reverse. We have illumination, truth coming to light, clarity, and you thinking about wanting to go back to this is four of cups, uh, thinking or actually ignoring an offer. That's fine. Because besides this offer, we have the Ace of Cups in reverse. This offer, this offer here is not going to be your Ace of Cups in upright. This offer here is going to be in reverse. It's not going to serve you at its best. It's not going to serve you at its best. You don't have to remember all that I'm saying. Just remember, any person who comes back from the past, no. Ignore or just kindly reject it. Kindly reject it. Bottom of the deck, we have the Knight of Cups. Even the Knight of Cups is coming back. From like in many videos that I've done, I said this to me in this direction, this is looking like going back to the past. From where I come from, this is like the roads. This is going back. This is going back. This is not going forward. I come from a right hand drive, right hand drive, so this is going back. And for those of you who are in a left hand drive, this will be this will be coming, coming, coming towards you. Oh yeah, actually, whichever the case, we have this Knight of Cups coming. Yeah, I think actually, yeah, you might, I mean, we can also put it that way. This is going, coming to you coming back to you or coming towards you doesn't matter right hand drive or left hand drive as i'm speaking i've got that clarity now okay so this is coming towards you the knight of cups which is i told you it is not going to be good only new person only new person or existing contact that's all i'm going to tell you if any one of you for love, if you haven't started any relationship with anyone, I mean with your current contact, you can go ahead. It is safe to do so. For anyone, your ex is coming back, never. Business partner, never. Past job, past company, past colleagues, never. Friends who, whom you were not on good terms with, never. Right? Never. But friends whom you have lost contact, but not falling out due to bad terms, I think that is still fine. Well, but try to avoid because what's going to work for you is the existing. Existing people whom you have been talking with, whom you're in contact with, whom you're connecting with, still is the right person for you. It's the right one. It's the person, it's the group of people who's going to help you to break through in this year. In a way, they will inspire you, they will give you inspirations, they will be positive to, uh, um, they will be, they will, they will, you know, they will help you in one way or another, indirectly, they might inspire you with some ideas with whatsoever, right? So Taurus, this is for your whole year of 2019, like I said, you don't have to remember all that I'm saying, just remember the past, no, 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 okay? Till then, I will see you in many more to come. Ciao, take care, bye.